Welcome to Collector Guys. One great part of collecting is converting an item from its original version to a version that the manufacturer never made or something you just can't find. Converting. It's how you create your own Mean Girl figures out of Polly Pockets. It's also a way to take a damaged item and bring it back to life. Quick disclaimer, conversions are usually not valued by other collectors, so altering a toy or any collectible will probably reduce its value considerably. Conversions should only be done for fun. Here is a great example of a conversion by a Marvel Universe collector. Marvel Universe, now called Marvel Legends Series, began in 2009 and is still sold by Hasbro today. Overall, the figures are very well done, with great sculpting, multiple points of articulation, and excellent paint. They were immediately a hit with kids and adults. One of the most amazing things about this line is its depth. Finally, collectors can purchase heroes and villains that had never been available before and at a reasonable price. However, there were a few hard-to-find pieces. Strangely enough, The Vision, one of the Avengers and a character that has been around for decades, was released in small numbers and very hard to find. The secondary market responded by selling the figure online for as much as 30 times the original value. Even today, the figure is still expensive to acquire. So it's a perfect candidate for a conversion creation. Quick note, this collector's conversion is an example of what can be done. If you want an expert step-by-step -step guide to creating exact models, this is not it. So on a trip to a flea market, the collector found another Marvel Universe figure that he already owned, Gladiator. Gladiator is primarily a character from the X-Men comics. While interesting, he is not incredibly popular, and the Marvel Universe version was overproduced by Hasbro. This meant that there was little demand and lots of figures. However, the figure is well sculpted and a good candidate for a conversion. There was one problem. He was missing his cape. Still, the collector bought the figure loose at the flea market for a dollar. To do the conversion, the collector looked closely at the Vision's costume and colors, and then at what changes would need to be made to the Gladiator figure. Next, he assembled his supplies. An X-Acto knife for cutting off plastic, epoxy for adding to the figure, thin plastic sheets for the cape, and hobby paints, specifically made to adhere to plastics. First, he washed the figure. Then he cut off Gladiator's unneeded plastic parts with the X-Acto, built up the middle, and filled in the head. Some sanding, a new cape, and a chest symbol then a base layer of white paint, and finally the careful use of paints. Gladiator's alien face was actually a good match for Vision, so little was changed there, and the eyes were left completely alone. So with just a little supplies and a little work, a $1 cast-off flea market Gladiator became one of Earth's mightiest heroes, the Avengers Vision. Have a conversion you did? Share it with us in the comments. Thanks for watching. We'd appreciate you subscribing to our channel. Until next time, that's Collector, guys.